Well, right now, a whole lot of cleanup going on after dozens of cars are damaged at a West Suburban dealership. And now we're learning more about exactly what happened overnight after Schaumburg police arrested the suspect. Here's CBS 2's Mugo Digwe. We've learned the suspect, who police say is in his 20s, didn't just damage the cars here at the Honda dealership. He did the same thing at the Patrick BMW and Ford dealerships, so three in total. It's much easier to see the damage in broad daylight. The back windshields of vehicle after vehicle smashed. You want to be angry, but I guess it doesn't do you much good. Matthew Ashford is the general manager at Schomburg Honda dealership. He says the suspect hit his dealership around 1.30 this morning. How long he was there, not clear, but he sure left a lot of damage behind. So we have about 83 cars uh, damaged. 20 of the cars belong to customers who dropped them off overnight for service. Which we're in the process of notifying the customers and uh, about 63 at latest count is our uh, own inventory. We spoke with Schomburg police this morning. They tell us the suspect was arrested as he was vandalizing other vehicles at a different dealership. Nothing was stolen, but for the dealerships affected, it's yet another issue to tackle. It's frustrating. Uh, you know, in this in this period right now of inventory shortage to not have the cars that I need right 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 now to sell is uh, is really a challenge for the customers whose cars were damaged. You know, unfortunately, they'll have to make claims through their insurance and uh, it's a very involved process for them. Police say they are still questioning the suspect and that charges should be coming down later in Schaumburg, Mugol Digwe, CBS 2 News.